I'm bringing you guys the Saints Row 4 unboxing. Well, not a proper one, but a good one at least. Um, it's the fuck, huh? It is the sorry about that. My retainer is messing up. It is the Saints Row 4 Super Dangerous Wub Wub Edition. Now, I know this isn't a proper unboxing because I didn't unbox everything for you. You saw some things in the back. You have all the you have your standard box art and all that stuff on this on the back of this with all the shit included. Now, we'll put that to the side and now we'll go back to what we've been really coming to see today. <laughs> all right. Here's the game. Of course, it's the Commander in Chief edition. We have the dubstep gun. It's a really small. I, I thought it'd be a little bigger, although they said it was 12 inches. Really, really disappointed me on that end. It does light up. You can see it's got a laser pointer, everything. Oh, yeah. Yeah, if you have a seizure, don't watch this. <laughs> Uh, uh. Next we have the Doomsday button, which has a key, very nice key, it's a little Saints Row emblem key, as the music stops playing, uh, there we go from here, we, un we, un we turn that there. And then we just pull the key out, or you can keep the key in. I prefer to keep the key out. I'm sorry, I'm doing this with one hand, so this might not be the best video. I'm holding the camera. Holding the camera. All right, now we got to get that open. It has Saints Row 4 on the top, and the speaker's right there. So while that's counting down, it'll do the bass drop from the standard song. Game box. Next is the thing that I've been waiting for this whole time. A lot. Besides the game, I've been waiting for this. Alright, now that's done, we'll close that down. Next we have the Johnny Gat Memorial, the last thing of the piece, of course. Memorial statue I've been, I was wanting for a while, and it was really, really cool. Now that I zoomed in, you can see the statue really good now. See the, all the little details in it. As you can see, it, it, it's the identical one from Saints Row 3. Identical Johnny Gat and everything from Saints Row 3 before he died. Or died, as they quote-unquote. Here is the... Yeah, it looks a, little, it looks a lot better now, because the camera is a lot better. Um, as I before, this is the Saints Row Doomsday button. The dubstep gun, which is right here. It's a little wet, since I accidentally spilled a little Mountain Dew on it earlier. But it's all good. There's a pointer. Up. Game box. And the box that all came in. And now, I'm going to go play the game. So, peace out guys. I hope you guys enjoyed this video, and I'll be bringing you guys gameplay as soon as I can get it up. Alright, see you guys. I'll catch you guys on the next Saints Row 4 video. Like if you enjoyed.